this picture looks absolutely amazing. Okay. Honestly, this looks absolutely amazing, this picture. I like it that they've included, like, nearly everything that's going to be in the update, but there's a few things that are missing, but it does look pretty cool. Let's play it. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, it's going to have to download. Oh, okay. Okay, guys, here we are. One MP remaining, and it's done. Oh, my goodness. Because I heard there could have been new loading screens um, in the game. Hey! Look, there it is! Oh, what? Wow! Whoa, that is crazy. That's awesome. Okay. The brand new launcher is absolutely crazy. I want to put this up to full screen now. Okay. The brand new loading screen. That was pretty cool. But the main screen hasn't changed that much, except for the background. So that's pretty nice. So, like, are there any new options? Ah, uh, is it new? I think this is new. That could be new. I'm not so sure, but that's cool. We've got this little thing here. Uh, what's this one for? Oh, okay. So, oh, that's like a quick shortcut to um, this setting here. So that I think that's for mostly, like, for settings for narrating chat text like to change how big you want the text to be auto jump cool so just a few extra settings i'm guessing so let's create a brand new world uh let's just call it 1.14 nothing special uh you know yep all that i want to have all like the generated structures so we can see everything that's new i just Okay, now that we've got that all sorted, let's go into create a new world. And let's just see if something fascinating is happening. Whoa! Okay, for a second I thought that black thing was a was something wrong with my monitor, but no. Oh my goodness. Wow, the loading screen is crazy. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, wow. That's crazy, like, is that supposed to represent, like, the Earth or something? And, okay, we're, we're here. Okay, grass hasn't changed that much. Um, <laughs> wow, look at this. Okay, this is crazy. Um, cool. Got a new flying trees now. Flying trees are now a brand new feature. Um, and what I have actually noticed is the looks for some of the blocks of... Yeah, so this one's definitely changed. I'm pretty sure this one's changed. Like, I'm pretty... Yeah, look, so... You can slightly tell that they've changed a few new looks for some... Yeah, like, see? We've got some... Well, that's a new feature, so that hasn't changed. But the jukebox definitely has. The cactus has definitely has. Wow, looks... Uh, you can't... S eh, I can't put... Oh, that's where I need sand. Oh, um... <laughs> And that's not, that's not working either. Uh, yeah, let's just have a look at it here. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the cactus is, the cactus has definitely changed. That's awesome. I've actually seen a few people make a few good videos about this, and this looks absolutely crazy. Like, I think if someone were to create an adventure map with this, I think there would be so much cool things to ha do with this. So, as an example, I could say, hello, person who came here and is reading this <laughs> um, I could sign it I guess uh, I guess yep sign enter book title um, hello person I guess <laughs> put it in and then they can come up and just just have a look at it and I think that'd be like really cool you can take the book you can you can duplicate it like if you want if you ever wanted to duplicate a book here you are. You can duplicate it. <laughs> but it looks really cool. I really like that indeed. That's pretty. That's a pretty cool feature, I've got to be honest. I'm actually really happy they haven't changed, like, a full-on new look for them. Like, they've just made it look a bit more different. And has that always been there? Because has that always been there, that cre creeper face there? I've never noticed that before. 
Because I've been on Minecraft for like a really long time and to not notice that is crazy. Because oh. that's what I was just about to say. Like they've added some new like extra dots onto the blocks type of thing, you know. Uh, <laughs> new look, which is cool. Uh, oh, oh, the dispenser has a little bit more new look. That's cool. Is it? Has it? I'm not so sure. But it, d it does look like a little bit to me, which is cool. Also got some new wall. Like, some new stuff to do as a wall, which is cool. Oh, look at this new stuff for, like, making new cool walls, like, for your farm and that. Like, I think walls will look so much more cooler with this. Yeah. <laughs> it looks awesome. Um, uh, ooh. Ooh, the, ooh, the armor's definitely changed. That's cool. Uh, the crossbow is here, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I think, yeah, it brings out a pretty cool animation for people to... Oh my goodness. Look at me. Watch out. <laughs> oh, oh, ow. Wow. Uh, what? Oh my goodness. That has gone far. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That... I think these things shoot much more, like, further than a normal arrow does. Um, Because I think I tested it once, and I think it does... Yeah, it, it definitely feels and looks like that to me. So I think that's pretty cool that these things are a bit more powerful, I guess. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool. I think... I'm not sure. I th we might have some new enchanted books, because I don't remember this being here at all. But that's cool. Um, okay. Um, ooh! Ooh! We have the compost. Well, we have the composter. The compu. Comp <coughs> we have the composter, which basically is pretty cool. I don't know how you really work this, but I, yeah. So I was just about to say, like, you also need sugar canes, which is cool. Um, and I think when you feed it, like stuff like this, I, I'm not sure if you need other stuff for it, but once you do. I think you right click it, yeah, and then gives you good old bone meal, so you can grow things with it. Bone meals are quite useful for things, so that's cool. Okay. I've just gone down to the bottom of my inventory, uh, creative inventory, and I've just seen this. Wow, this, all these blocks look so cool. Like, every single one looks so cool. Oh, we've already done that one. Uh, I'm going to grab these ones, uh, and we're going to go back for these ones later. Which is cool, but this one. Oh, cool. That's cool. Yeah, look at this chicken. You wanna have a go? You wanna have a go? Or do you wanna have a look at this? <laughs> yeah. Wow. Well, I, now I think what I've learnt is if you um, hit these bells in a village, the villagers actually run into their houses, or was it actually, um, to the bell, I'm not so sure, it was either one of those two, but these bells are actually pretty cool, so I'm not sure how far you can actually hear it, but it must be pretty big if the entire village can hear it, um, we've got the stone cutter, I'm not sure what it does, really, I haven't really, like, I think something like this used to be in Minecraft, but... Oh, okay, so... Oh, that's cool. So, yeah. What? Yeah, so I think something like this used to exist in Minecraft. I'm not so sure, but it was a pretty cool feature. Um, so this is a pretty cool feature. Uh, what's this one? So this one is really weird. Just, I, I, I guess it's just a, um... A decoration thing. I'm not so sure, sure. Like, it looks like a crafting table when I look at it. Honestly. Uh, <laughs> now we've got the gr the grind. The grindstone, yep. <laughs> so, I'm not sure. Okay, so. Ooh. Okay, so. It looks like it repairs items. So, if I grab a diamond sword. Actually, no, I'm going to get a bow. So what you have to do is you have to shoot a bow, and as you can see, it's taken a little bit of damage. So I'm pretty sure you right-click this, put it in, add in another one, and there you go. You've got a brand new, fresh 
bow. So I think if it's like really low, I think you actually do have to grab a brand new, like a fair few new bows. Um, and I think it takes away the enchantments maybe. I'm not so sure. It's quite weird. Uh, these mobs, yeah, they're not so fascinating still. You guys, maybe in the next update, guys, you, you might get some new friends. Who, who knows? <laughs> we just found a pillager. I think they're pillager um, outposts. Oh, my goodness. This thing looks crazy. Oh, my goodness. Look, a pillager. Hello. It's all prepared. Oh, no, this poor iron golem. You can stay in there, Mr. Iron Golem. I don't care about you. Uh, <laughs> Whoa, this thing looks absolutely crazy. Oh, my goodness. This is crazy. Where, like, what they are. Oh, we've got a chest up here. Oh, these banners are absolutely looking awesome. Hello. Mind if I go on your chest? No? Okay. Cool. Uh, okay, so you get a potato, some string, oh, bottle of enchantment. So, that's cool. Some wood, some wheat. It would actually be super hard to probably, um, like, get in there. Because if you spawn near one, you might be in a bit of danger. So you know what? I'm going to try and break in there myself, all by myself, and see how well I go. Wish me luck. Okay. They don't see me. Oh, yep. Yeah, now they do. Now they do. Oh, my goodness. Can we get in there with full lives? Uh, you don't, you don't mind, don't mind me, sir. Yep. Oh my goodness. They sound mad. FBI, open up! Oh! Oh no! Oh no! Okay, I am so his head block. Oh my goodness. Ugh. Okay. Oh, you, you're here. Get him out of oh, here. <laughs> oh, okay. He can st still shoot me. <laughs> oh my goodness! These things are crazy! Oh, oh my goodness! <laughs> this is crazy! I'm gonna have to, like, get some extra blocks up in here. Wow! These things are definitely, like, absolutely out of this world. Like, these things are probably one of the best new mobs that have been added, like... That new mob that came in with the aquatic update, like, I'm going to be honest, that wasn't a really cool new mob, even though it, f like, flies and everything. This one is definitely, oh my goodness, they follow me. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, wow, so, there you are. Oh my goodness, the arrows. Yeah, <laughs> but there you are, the pillager outpost. Looks pretty cool. Um, I probably, I wouldn't suggest it to go straight here as soon as you spawn it and try and defeat them all and try and make this your home because it might be one difficult challenge. <laughs> um, it would be cool, like, it would be cool to come here as soon as, as soon as you spawn here, but you'd probably need to get some materials to do so. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what I'm going to do now is we are going to go to a to the vi a to a village <laughs> and try and see if we can see if there's anything new there as soon as I get this done there we are um probably wasn't a good idea to come here in survival mode Okay, let's try that again. Back here. Awesome. Hello, guys. Okay. Oh, we've started off where the bell is. So, let's... Oh, my goodness. This thing looks crazy. You guys are absolutely crazy. So, honestly, coal is probably one of the most easiest things to get in Minecraft. So, like, 9 times 15 would be, like, um... <laughs> Like 135, so that's pretty cool. Awesome. That's actually pretty easy. Um, so actually, before we go and check out all the other villages, um, oh my goodness, the cats as well. So much to explore. The Pelagian village update. Villager update.
<laughs> it's like, what did they just call us? Alright, so let's go do this bell and watch what happens. Oh! Okay, so they do go to the house. Okay. Hello. That's cool. And the iron golem just stays out here. That's pretty cool. So, oh, this looks very nice. Oh, okay. Nothing much in there. Uh, th this must be like bakery section, I guess. Uh, I I'm gonna be honest. Like, I feel like they've kind of made um villages not just look more cooler, but make them a bit more wider, I guess, which is okay. Uh, like, what's in the houses we can get? Yellow beds. That's cool. Um, oh, wait, oh, I've just noticed something, a new message, like, oh, I'm gonna have to sleep through the night to show you the new message, uh, <laughs> what's that set, okay, so you can only sleep at night and during thunderstorms, oh, that is cool, okay, so that's gonna be useful for, like, new people who play Minecraft, that's cool, um, so, sorry, villagers, uh, Anything up out here? Oh, got a chest. Oh my goodness. Villagers will provide you with a lot of food here. <laughs> wow, that's that's awesome. Wow. Got six bread, four oak, saplings, uh, and then Oh my goodness. Um I'm I'm a terrible neighbour. <laughs> um two potatoes and seven apples. That's pretty good. And we've got some fish just hanging out here in the ocean with the squid. I think what I think what would be cool is if Mojang made it that squids would sometimes eat fish. Like, that'd be a cool feature. I, I know that's a bit weird, but it'd be a pretty cool feature. <laughs> um, okay, let's check out the villages now. Ooh, 22 carrots for one emerald, and one emerald for six bread. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh my goodness, these, like, looks for the villages are awesome. I love the hat. Like, I wish you can, like, um craft or get a hat in minecraft which would be cool um so let's actually get some carrots uh, no golden one uh so do they okay so oh okay okay so see the bar there that's growing i think does that mean like it's going to um get a brand new thing to trade with so Let's just grab a whole bunch of these. Uh, where'd the farmer go? Hello, I know you. I know you're doing this, but I'm really sorry. Uh, let's put this here. Oh my goodness, you exploded with enchantments! <laughs> oh my goodness, yes! Oh wow, so. Oops, sorry, sorry, sorry. Um, yes. Uh, let's get some like carrots up in here. I want to see what else I can try and get. Oh, oh, he, you're on the edge of. Uh, oh, I can't. So I can't give that. So I'm just gonna have to grab one more carrot, a bit, a few more carrots. Go back to you. And, oh, okay. So, oh, yeah, look. So, oh yes, some cookies. Who would ignore that? Oh my goodness, that's absolutely awesome. Punk. Uh, no, sorry, I need to say pumpkins. <laughs> Melons. Um, so I think if you spawn in a jungle, you won't have a hard time trying to find these. So that's a pretty cool thing. Thank you, sir. Um, honestly, I think their trades have improved slightly a little bit more. Um, could be useful once you have a fair bit of these materials. So thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Um, oh, we've got you over here. Hello, sir. You got nothing to trade with me? What? Okay, uh, that's weird. Is that what it means? Like when they do that with their heads? Because that's actually really cool. So, no, okay, I don't think they do. Okay, that's a really useful, uh, villager. <laughs> um, that's cool. So, nothing from you, nothing from you. What about you? Oh, you, oh you're, you're the armor guy. Okay, so actually, let's see what we can get from you. When we want to, oh, I just put the suit on. Uh, um, let's actually clear the inventory so we have enough. So let's get coal. A fair bit of the coal here because I think he asked for some coal emeralds. Um, let's grab a bit of these. Okay, 
to go to you. Um, and try and see. Ooh, ooh. Oh, that was cool. So, I just noticed that the, the white bar that just appeared means how much more, like, XP he will gain to go to a new trade. So, that's cool. Um, don't go away from me. I want to get some things. Can... You don't upgrade. Why don't you upgrade? Oh, you don't have anything on you for today, sir. No. Oh, wait. Yes, there he is. Oh, oh, that's cool. Okay, so that's pretty cool. So he does like discount type of things, but only by like one percent by the looks. <laughs> um, no, you don't. You don't want me. No. Oh. Yeah, they are. Hello. That's cool. That's really cool. Awesome. Well, thank you, sir. Again. Once again, you got even more lava. Yeah, that's a pretty good trade. Lava for emeralds. That's a pretty good trade. Okay, so the one thing we haven't looked at is the foxes, which looks absolutely amazing. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. Absolutely beautiful. Did it have, like, wheat? Yeah, it had wheat in its mouth and... Are you going to try and eat some fish? Oh my goodness, is it? It's going to be cool. Fox fish, fish, who will win? Oh my goodness, it's actually happening. They actually do it. Oh my goodness, wow! That is cool. So, you know what I do want to do? Spawn all these foxes in to get some fish. I'm so mean to these fish. <laughs> oh, so, wait, did they drop it? Oh, yeah, so he dropped it to get something else, which is cool. Um, man, I'm so mean to these fish. Poor fish. <laughs> Look at this squid just chilling out during the whole event. <laughs> okay, so, we got berries, don't we? So, yeah, we got berries. Some sweet berries, which looks absolutely amazing. Um... Okay, that's what we've been there. So let's actually check these out because these look amazing. Okay, of course they start from scratch. Uh, let's get a bone meal. Check it out. Hey. Okay, so you get at least like one to three berries max, I'm guessing, out of it. Yeah, so one between three is how many berries you will get. Um, go away from me, please. Uh, oh, I've just noticed this fox over here that's chilling out. Alright, so this is cool. Um, uh, what was it? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> just checking out that, like, blacksmith is chilling out. Um, but yeah, yeah, so it looks like only, like, three, like, one to three berries you get from these. May I'm not sure. It could be more. Uh, yeah, I just keep getting three out of there at the moment. But yeah, that's that's pretty cool. That's a pretty cool thing to see. Awesome. So I just noticed, um, I was just going through the inventory, and I just noticed how these look so much more better than the old version. Because they had, like, all of these nearly, like, everywhere. Um, but they've made it much more clear, clearer. Cl 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 ah. But they've made this look, like, much more better. So you don't have to try and dodge these in the middle to see um, perfectly outside. I should fix that. <laughs> what is that sound? Is that, is that the foxes that... Oh, actually, that's a pretty cool feature I've just noticed. It's... A, oh, okay, so I'm not sure, you guys might not understand, but it sounds like at... At night, you can hear... What, what, what was that all about? <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, so it sounds like you can... At night time, like, real-life foxes, they might make, like, noises. Like, they're calling to other foxes and that. Which actually is pretty cool. <laughs> now, the one thing we haven't really looked at is the campfires, which are pretty cool. I'm going to say the most best feature in the entire um, updates that have ever came. Because now, you put them down, and they 
Oh, the noise also sounds cool. Like, this is, without a doubt, the best feature that have, like, ever came in any of the new updates lately. Like, the aquatic update was cool. Um, like, sure, the um, pillages are pretty cool. But this is probably one of the most best new features that have came in. Like... I think this is going to be really cool for people who want to do, like, a new survival series in the 1.14 update. And I think what is really cool about these campfires is that when you right-click them with, um, not cooked food, you do this. Oh my goodness, look at that. That looks absolutely amazing. And then, as you can see, the... Are being cooked. I was, I was gonna say like slowly being cooked, uh, which is true, but it looks are they like I'm not sure. I can't tell if their skins are changing slightly. Uh, you can't grab. I'm not sure if you can grab it out without right clicking it. So I'm, I'm gonna try it here. Do it here. Right click. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Oh. What's that? Oh. 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 Okay. So there, there's our answer there. They pop out themselves. Honestly, that's a really cool feature. The smokes go pretty high. So much more better than just a normal everyday torch. Smoke's higher. And this barely does any good smoke. So, sorry, torch. No one's going to love you anymore. <laughs> Look at this guy. He's also... Yeah, it's pretty good, isn't it? It's a pretty good feature. <laughs> So I've just realized, as you can see, um, if you've recently been watching Mojang's new trailers with the Village and Pillage update, they've been showing a lot about these new two mobs. Um, so this is... Oh, oh no. Oh, oh no. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. He's gone. I went into peaceful. It's got, it's, it's all good. Okay. Where, where'd he go? Okay. I'm, I'm so young, sir, but do you have anything to trade? Oh, my goodness. Yes. Wow. <laughs> Gunpowder for one emerald. A red dye for one emerald. Kelp for three emeralds. Brown mushroom for one. White dye for one. And a bubble coal block for three. Hmm. Actually, look. So, what if I spawn another one? Does that get an... Yeah, okay. So, these things... They all have, like, different types. Which is cool. I, so, I'm not really sure, like, where they are. Like, where they mostly are. I think these things... These... I think these, um, new mobs just spawn randomly in different biomes. Because I don't think they mostly, um, spawn in villages. I'm not really sure. They could... They mostly would appear at villages... But I, th I think, like, with a llama and these things always walking around with these awesome new materials, I think they would mostly just be wandering around the entire world. So, yeah, that's what I think about these things. These things are probably pretty cool. The villagers and this guy do some pretty good trades, um, I think, which is really good about this update with the villagers. Another small little cool f feature that's been added in this update is when you see weird things, like maybe not, not that weird, but uh, like weird things that shouldn't be happening in Minecraft, that you think shouldn't be happening, all you have to do is go here and you've got give feedback or report bugs. And these things are absolutely awesome. All you have to do is click them and then do open in browser which will just take Minecraft down and open the internet for you straight to this link um, or copy to clipboard which will just be there for you just to paste in the link in chat I guess and people can click it or copy it you know that type of stuff which is cool um, give feedback again if you want, have any ideas or anything with the mobs or biomes and that just give feedback on what you think about them. Again, it will just take you to the website or just copy it to for you and just put put it in chat, you know, all that stuff. So I think that's an awesome feature in Minecraft, which is going to be really helpful f for so many people in the future in Minecraft, which is going to be pretty cool.
especially as like especially for those who do beta testing for Minecraft, it's going to be really useful. Like I know we might be doing some beta testing in the future on this channel because I've I've enjoyed looking through all these new features that have came in to Minecraft. So again, thank you, Myjang, for this. So I can't wait to see how they will top all of this up with 1.15, which who knows? It could include the sky space update. That'd be a pretty cool feature like oh my goodness imagine if minecraft did that honestly i think that would be a pr crazy update like probably better than every update combined in minecraft what about you mr villager ever wanted to go to space yep yep yeah don't need to go that close to me to tell me yes gee <laughs> if you want me to do more sh showcases like this, all you have to do is like this video, and if you don't want to miss out on it either, just subscribe to the channel and put on the notification bell, which would be greatly appreciated for my channel. Anyway guys, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching again. Bye!